to another studio vlog. So I thought I would film a little intro for you because yeah, lots of exciting things happened this week. Um, so this is actually Emma from Friday. So you will see me again a little bit later. But yes, we had lots of exciting things in the post. We had some Ikea shelving. Um, which is going to be for the new studio and uh, yes so very excited and there will be a studio tour coming very very soon which I feel like I've been saying for ages but we're like we're nearly nearly there also the enamel pins came I'm actually wearing one of them so that's a little sneaky peek but yes I unboxed those so you will see this version of me again later on and there's also lots of good plant footage and some packing orders as well so yeah lots of things so i hope you enjoy it and yeah let's get into the video hi everyone it is monday now welcome to another studio vlog so the last studio vlog i ended with the fact that my ipad wasn't working and yeah it actually ended on a sunday which was yesterday so basically yesterday we were trying to fix the ipad all day and yeah it just basically wasn't turning on so we tried like um updating it lots and yeah it just wasn't doing anything and then we even tried restoring it and it still wasn't turning on so i've got an appointment on saturday to have it fixed um i'm kind of hoping that it might just marax miraculously fix itself um it's like i've had it for less than a year so it should all be covered in the in the warranty so that's good at least and yeah we're so the plan today is to actually finish these woodland stickers <laughs> that i was so nearly done with like last week when i was working on them on the ipad but yeah we're hopefully gonna try and finish those and yeah either i'll finish them off on photoshop maybe or i'm not sure we'll, we'll get them done anyway i am wearing my workout clothes because i'm about to do yoga and i'm doing yoga with adrian's 30 day challenge i think i'm on day 22 today um i'm really pleased that i'm getting back into it again um yeah it's i'm really enjoying it and the other uh, I'm so excited I can't talk. <laughs> the other exciting thing that's happening today is that the IKEA shelving should be coming sometime today. So yeah, I'm very excited for that. It's apparently meant to be arriving when Tom's at work, so I'm gonna have to carry it in by myself. I will show you maybe a little sneak peek, um, but yeah, that means soon in the future, I can actually do this like new studio tour which i'm very excited about anyway yes i'm gonna go do yoga and then hopefully do these stickers this vertebra nice and strong and we'll straighten through that front leg and tilt it forward up and back the ikea stuff has arrived as you can see um i don't <laughs> i don't think i can get this really up the stairs but maybe i can open the boxes and take them up one at a time. I could just leave it here till Tom <laughs> gets home, maybe. Oh my god. So I've unpacked all the IKEA boxes. I'm really warm actually. <laughs> but yes, I think I'm gonna get Tom to help me do this um, probably tomorrow. And yeah, that means that the room is kind of slowly coming together. And it means that there's gonna be like a little new room tour soon. So yeah, looking forward to doing that. I'm so warm. <laughs> oh, cup of tea time. Tommy's investigating the packaging. Is this the biggest box you've ever seen, Tommy? It's huge, isn't it? <laughs> You're such a tiny cat. You don't need such a big box, do you? Hello. Hello. You all right? Got myself a cup of tea. I've actually cooled down, so I think I might put my jumper back on. Yeah, the task I'm going to do now is in this box I've got a load of dino pins that for some reason 
I didn't sort through all the dino pins. So, um, and I've actually run out on my shop because I ran out of all the ones that I'd like sorted through. So I'm gonna look through these um, and then yeah, sort them out into like first or seconds. Yeah, this is what the dino pin looks like if you've never seen him. Um, but yeah, I had somebody message me that really wanted one. So I thought I should probably sort these out and put them back on my shop. Okay, so luckily I did actually save this copy of the Woodlands stickers that I'd started. So yeah, I'm gonna actually finish this off on Photoshop because the iPad is still not working. Um, but yeah, so I'm just gonna use my graphics tablet. And as you can see, I've done like all the animals. I was planning on doing a couple of like little toadstools and some like extra leaves and then just do some like stars and then I just need to do the names. I might add a little bit more detail on the scarves actually as well. But other than that, it's pretty much done. You can see it is very dark outside. I'm wearing Tom's jumper. Tom has come home, yay, Tom's home. <laughs> and he um, wanted to get cracking already. So he's made a start. Well done, Tom. Good work, good work. Also, we have this nice plant corner at the moment, which is looking very nice. Do we have more plants coming tomorrow, Tom? 11. 11 tiny little baby plants coming tomorrow. I'm excited. I love the puzzled face. <laughs> does, does, does it not have any writing on it? Do they never have writing no, on it? No, they never do, they're annoying. <laughs> It's like a puzzle though. We like um, we like puzzles. I've been trying to put out what that is, that's a spirit level. Oh <laughs> wow. I was looking at it, what is that? It looks like some clippers <laughs> Nail clippers. Yeah. Can opener. I think we'll play for tomorrow to do this. Yeah. Because I don't think the drills, I need to drill them. Yeah, I don't think the neighbours will appreciate well, it. It says just to mark it, but I'm gonna put the tiny hole. Yeah. Good plan. Yeah, I don't think the neighbours will appreciate drilling right now, will they? <laughs> well done for making a start, though. They're so beautiful. <laughs> Hello, it is Tuesday today. So today we've been for a run. We is me and Tom. And then I've done some yoga. Tom has made a bit more of a start to the shelving, which is looking really good. And Tom has gone off to work. So he's missed, um, he ordered these, these are like tiny little plants in here from a shop called Botanical, which is in Norwich, but they have like an online shop as well. But yeah, so he ordered like a bunch of like tiny little plants, but he said that when they arrived that I could open them. It's like the same colour tissue paper I use. Yeah. I wonder if these are the ones that can... Is this proper polystyrene or is this potato starch? These remind me of the things in Lush that you can dissolve in water. I don't know if they are them. They don't really feel like polystyrene. They're kind of squishy. Oh, first tiny plant. I'm really excited. <laughs> I think these are gonna look really cute. But yeah, obviously buying the plant tiny means it's a little bit cheaper, but also, um, yeah, we were saying it might be kind of fun just to kind of then watch it grow. Oh, you come. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, it's so small. <laughs> Oh, this one's nice. Mm. 
Ooh, pretty. This one looks like the, I'm not sure if this is another Devil's Ivy. I think we might have got one of those because we got, or it's the same sort of family, but yeah, we've got like a huge one of these downstairs. We've just got two left. Oh, there's a tiny cheese plant. I don't know if they actually say on the pots what they are. No, that would be the only thing. Like, if there could be a list of what we'd ordered, <laughs> because I cannot remember. I guess it would be like on the email or whatever. Oh, this one is pretty. Anything with pink on it. <laughs> but yeah, I really, really love these tiny little plants. They are so, <laughs> they're so sweet. Obviously, um, it would be really cool to see them like grow, but actually they look really sweet, like just this size as well, just like a kind of mini jungle. So here is a size comparison. These are like normal size plants. And look. Here's the little baby plants. Oh my goodness, don't they look so adorable? I think they look really cute next to the big plants. <laughs> but yeah, I hope they all do okay. I'll definitely give you updates like in future vlogs of how they're getting on. So it's Thursday today, which is one of my packing orders day. So yeah, I'm gonna pack some orders. And then I think for the rest of the day, I'm just gonna carry on with some book illustrations. I've been trying to do like work on this project at least one day a week. And seeing as my iPad is not working, it seems definitely like a good day to do it. So yeah, I'm gonna pack orders and then do some drawing all day, which sounds good. and I also had a few orders of like print on demand stuff and I realized that I never actually show you the print on demand like items that I have because I'm not actually posting them myself and um, so that's all done through Printful but I thought just in case you're interested I'll put up on the screen somewhere some of the items that I have so I have prints I have cushions and I have a couple of mugs as well. The cushions have been doing quite well, like I've got these sort of like bookish cushions um, with my giant book um, illustrations on them and I do them as prints as well. And um, also my, I can actually show you my autumnal ghost mug, which you've probably seen because I've been using this quite a lot because it's kind of getting autumnal. So yeah, I, I really like this mug. Also, speaking of post, I have just received this and I think this might be a gift from Alaki who she sent me a message saying that she was she wanted to send me some of her items because she's just opened an Etsy shop and um, she's also just started doing studio vlogs as well. So I think that's what this is. I'm going to open it though and find out. Right. Ooh. Ah. Oh, this is really cute. I like the way it's been wrapped up. Yeah, so this, this is from Adagi because I watched her studio vlog the other day and I really like this like stack of books bookmark. That's really cute. And then these are all her details where you can follow her. Yeah, this is a note. I will read that separately. Yeah, and then she's sent me some cards. So she sort of has these kind of like puns <laughs> fan thank you 
and share positivity and let's get a coffee chat for hours and forget about the belt so yeah that's really really sweet of her to send me these um i will leave a link in the description so you can go and check out her shop and also her youtube channel so yeah thank you alaki i am really really excited because i have just received an order which is the new woodland enamel pins and yeah i'm really really excited and really yeah excited to like unbox these together with you so i will put like in the cards and also in the description if you want to see me join the woodland enamel pins and basically what happened i feel like i need to do a kind of like uh previously on emma carpenter <laughs> studio vlogs kind of maybe with like um, Anthony Stewart Head doing the voiceover, um, like Buffy style. Um, me and Tom have been re-watching Buffy by the way. Um, but yeah, previously <laughs> on my studio vlogs I was designing these enamel pins and I'd planned on only doing three um, but then I came up with six designs and I found it really hard to choose. So I asked on YouTube and I also asked on Instagram for you to help me choose which enamel pins. And I made a tally chart and everything and it was actually really, really close. So yeah, so I actually ended up ordering them all. So yeah, I'm really excited. So let's, yeah, let's open this box and see what they look like. Here we go, here we go. This is a big box as well. I've never I've never ordered six pins at one go. I'm very, very excited. <gasps> okay. As usual, they come in a million bits of plastic. But I started making an eco brick with the last lot of plastic so I'm going to be shoving them in there not the pins obviously just the plastic okay so first up see if it will focus so first up we have the hedgehog and oh it's so cute I have done all the woodland animals wearing scarves so they're kind of like a set but yeah so i'm gonna sell them as a set and i'm gonna sell them individually as well but yeah and this hedgehog's got little tiny wellington boots and yeah they've all got little leaves on them as well so they're very like autumnal or even like kind of winter and christmasy so that's the hedgehogs then which one should we go for next Oh my goodness it's dinky <laughs> this looks so tiny <laughs> oh it's cute though let's compare it to that one i think because the height of it is like a similar height but it, obviously the hedgehog is quite a bit wider yes yeah, so this bunny just ends up looking so dinky and cute kind of similar to my um my daisy cat as well that is a very dinky pin it's hard to show this without reflecting the camera because obviously the cam... Oh, and to get it in focus as well. Come on, you can do it. So here is the bear. I think this is really cute. I think this would be a really nice, like, kind of, like, Christmassy pin, actually. It's really sweet. I was worried as well that it would look too much like a dog. But, yeah, I think it definitely does look more like a bear. It's really cute. <laughs> Do the foxes. Oh. The foxes look so good. The foxes might be my favourite. I don't know. It's really hard to choose. Oh, the fox is lovely. Yeah, so the fox is on rose gold. It looks so nice. And it's covered in leaves. And it's got a blue scarf. Yeah, I think the fox might be my favourite. Some of these pins have got two, like, kind of clasp things on the back, by the way. So I think depending on, like, the kind of size and, like, shape of the pin. Yeah, love that. Oh, so cute. Here's the badger. So the badger is silver. And it's got little yellow Wellington boots. It's 
really really cute and last but not least e we have this little rose gold squirrel with an umbrella i think this actually might be my favorite I don't know, tell me which one your favourite is because yeah, it's just really hard to choose. Oh, so cute. Right, so now I've got a lot of pins to put on backing cards. I already ordered the backing cards quite a while ago when I did my last pins, so let me show you. Okay, so these are all the new pins and yeah, I think they're all so cute. I think they make a really nice set and yeah so now I've got these backing cards which actually I ordered these when I did my last pin set because I like I knew that I'd design these so I thought I'd order the backing cards at the same time so yeah now I'm gonna just get on and check all of the pins make sure they're all okay and put them on the backing cards Oh, I think the backing card looks so cute. Like having them on top of all the leaves, that's really sweet. So cute! today on my outfit um i think i might wear the fox one let me get a foxy out i think that's gonna look really cute i think that's what like dungarees and like pinafore dresses are really good for what do you think does it look cute <laughs> i think it looks quite cute yeah so now i've got a lot <laughs> A lot a lot of pins to go through um so yeah i think i'm gonna get started because it might take me a while <laughs> and yeah once i've gone through them all then i need to take some product photos as well don't think i'm gonna get that done today but i will definitely show you that in the vlog <laughs> basically we've just come back from the appointment and they've said that it looks like it's in good condition like I've treated it well but for some reason it's like just not turning on and they think the screen might actually be broken so yeah I'm gonna get a new one and that's gonna be here within a week um so yeah I'm without an iPad for another week but at least it's getting all sorted because it was in the warranty so that's good um sneaky peek of how the room is looking. Yeah, it's getting there. So that's really exciting. Um, also update on the stickers. I am really, really tempted to get either a silhouette or a Cricut machine. I need to kind of work out which one I want. But yes, I haven't ordered the Woodlands animal stickers yet because I kind of, I've been thinking that I want to either buy the silhouette or the cameo. No, 
that's wrong, the silhouette cameo or the crickets. So just another quick update. I have actually bought a Cricut Explore Air 2 and I bought this on the Sunday. So that was the day after you just last saw me. And yeah, I'm really, really excited to have a play around on this. I'm waiting for some sticker paper, but it's been dispatched. So soon I can have a go at this. And yeah, the Woodlands animal stickers will definitely be coming soon. So yeah, watch this space. So yeah, originally I did sort of think it'd be cool to have these woodland stickers at the same time as the woodland pins, but I just really want to get the pins out now because um, I know a lot of you were really excited about them as well. So yeah, at the time that this video is out, the woodland animal pins are in my shop. So that will be linked in the description as always. And yeah, let me know which one your favorite is. Uh, but yeah, that's all for now, and I will see you in the next video. Okay, bye. Thank you for coming. I know that you're trying to 